All right, good evening, sorry friends. I should say good morning. It's already a little after one. Matter of fact, let me see exactly what time. Wow, 149. Mitty man yet at it. We give God all the praise and glory. We thank him for life, health, and strength. And we thank him for as well as it is. And thank you for all of you, your cyber friends. You know who you are. We just come to say, people, that we are so grateful tonight. Um, we are very grateful that um, the Lord has allowed old Mitty man to uh, get a few things in order. And I talked to a few uh, people that was a little bit up under the weather today, some of my pastor friends, Pastor Brenda, and I talked to my one of my singers, Sonya. She was been under the weather, I talked to her, talked to Lola, another one of my singers and everything. And we just glad that, that everybody's doing as well as they are. Matter of fact, I saw some comments from my sister Jackie and sister Jennifer and which is Jennifer is newly on my contact list. It's one of my favorite from now on. And we just thank God for that. And I talked to my brother Maxwell, or uh, David Maxwell on the thing. We got something planned for y'all. They're coming up real soon. So y'all keep your ears and your eyes open for it. And we just thank God. And I'm taking a break right here. Uh, I I had to get me a little rest, in other words. Uh, I uh, got my church anniversary at my home church on Sunday and so I am going to take a little break and get myself ready. I was a little bit I was a little bit exhausted on the day. I, I did a little bit of moving around and computer work. I had to do a little computer work today um, at City Hall. I had to go and take care of some printer work down there to get some printers online and whatnot as well as another client of mine. I had to do some internet problems and get, get some connectivity problem that they was having so I did that and so old middle man was a little bit exhausted after I got done with all of that so I decided I would take me a little break and uh, get myself built up for Sunday but I did come back to just let y'all know that I'm taking a break right now I am back into the composition mode I'm back in music composition mode and uh, I want to let my sister Jackie and know and as well as my sister Jennifer let y'all know that I, I got the I got the software loaded up even as I talk on this video right now. But we um something we just taking a little break, a little sidebar here just because I knew I should have did this video. I should have tried to do this video a little bit earlier, but I didn't. Uh but we thinking, like I said, we 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 own our, we own a mission, people, and uh all we got is time. Jesus, the lay is coming. All of us got time to do what we need to do. The Lord give us his grace and his mercy. And I do believe he's going to do that. And uh, we all, uh, I got some, uh, I got a lot of work that I got to try to get done compositionally, music composition-wise. Uh, uh, I still got to get my song, the one I wrote years ago. I'm going to redo it when the people in the church get saved as well as two other ones. I got them on the back burner right now, and that's how I come on working with this software that I'm working with. I started working with it and uh, doing some little uh, interactive tutorial with it to learn the software so I can move around within it real good. That notation software, each one of them, most of them, they worked almost by the light, but they just got different features, something to do the same thing. They got different ways of doing the same thing, I say it like that. So that's why Middle Man is taking a break here, and uh, we just going on and say that we are thankful, and we are grateful. Uh, we, like I said, we had our little bit of great grand went on back home tonight, uh, earlier tonight, and so we uh, had kept Ren Ren all summer long, and uh, we uh, have certainly enjoyed the little great grand, and uh, we uh, automatically we don't miss her. You know, we, we don't got used to her being around every day and everything. So when we started picking up toys, I went around the, the night and picked up some of her favorite toys that she loved, her, her little old stuffed animal like Mickey and Tommy and all of her little bitty car that she had when she was a little bitty baby. She still got that car we got. We keep it in that other room over there. We keep it full. We, let it, we keep it up. So, you know, when you sit down, and, like I said, people, we need to think on good things. In other words, I, I often think about it, you know, we need to be, we can think positive. 
even though sometimes we may not feel like being positive, but let's think positive anyway. And let's think, let's, let's, let's reach for the best and think the best and hope for the best. Even though sometimes we, will, we may not receive the best, but let us hope for the best at any rate. You know, God is on our side. He's always for us, people. And God is always for us. You ain't got to worry about that. So just remember that old middle man. Like I said, I got my podcast and uh, that I do, Inspirational Connection and everything. And that's something that me and, like I told y'all, my brother David Maxwell out of Philly, he the one turned me on to that one, as well as my brother Richard Butler turned me on to that that live streaming uh, thing. I think it's called Playground or something. But anyway, y'all know what I'm talking about. You can live stream. It's sending you uh, live stream straight to YouTube. It's a good application and everything. And the only thing about it, people, I sometimes old middle man, I I put too many irons in the fire. That's been one of my one of my biggest downfalls. As far as not uh, uh, getting to stuff done, not procrastination, but but attempting too many things. Sometimes I attempt too many things, and I put too many irons in the fire, and therefore I don't get a whole lot done, and I get myself get I get a little bit skewed out of the way, and that is not a good thing to do. In other words. I am a person of variety. I love that. I, I love variety. I love diversity. And that, I, I can't, I don't like to get stuck in a rut or doing the same old thing over and over, day after day, day, night after night. I don't like that. And so, therefore, many men will try to attempt a lot of things to keep, keep myself interested because I lose interest just like that. If it's not good, if, if you got to, it got to be something to hold my interest. It got to be a okay. In other words, I don't like mess, but I do like progress. In other words, I like progress. So in other words, we just saying that we are thankful for all of you cyber friends. You know y'all, every one of you, every one of you. Um and we are we are we are kind of excited because we got we're really excited because we're getting back into the mode of composition, music composition where I used to be when I was in college. And I lost, somewhere along the line, I lost the motivation and I lost the instinct of doing that at will. And I used to do a lot of writing, but now I do. I did not, I, I had stopped doing it. But now I, know I have gotten the appetite back to do a lot of composition. So therefore, I am reinforcing myself. I'm, I'm reacquainting myself with some of the, the, the musical ideas and terms and stuff and the, the discipline of music composition that I used to do when I was in college. And I am excited about that. So y'all just pray for me, the man. That pray for me, the man's strength. Health-wise, the doctor say I'm doing pretty good. My, my vascular surgeon, I told y'all another night that I got a very, very great report from my vascular surgeon when the last ultrasound I got. All the veins, everything was, I mean, did both sides of my neck and everything. The old left leg, you know, that's where my amputation took place at. Matter of fact, I had two amputations on that left foot. The big toe, as well as the one next to that, uh, half of that one, had to get, you had to get rid of. But, but middle man is doing great. Don't let nobody fool you. Middle man is doing pretty good, and I thank God for my sister Jack for let, for for letting Melissa know about me. And Melissa, we showed you thank you so much, and we're never gonna forget you for what you have told me and the information you gave me. Health wise, I feel a whole lot better just since I started doing what you had told me to do too. I feel a whole lot better. So, with that being said, Middle Man gonna go ahead on. We're gonna sign off with this here now. And they say y'all keep praying for Middle Man. Middle Man gonna keep praying for y'all. And remember, whatever you get, whatever you get into, if God ain't in it, get out of it because it's gonna come to nothing. Let us remember, people. Let us keep praying for the, the America. Don't let us let us don't let us forget that because I mean we just fresh off these here mass killings. We don't want any more. We don't want any more. We can help it. But, you know, like I said, we got to realize, people, these things are going to go on it's until Christ comes and set up. There will be no real peace until the Prince of Peace come back. But until then, we can pray that God's will will be done in this earth. And we can do what we can do. When we see things that are not right, report it to the authorities. People, when you out and about in these malls and stuff, and you see stuff that don't look quite kosher, let somebody know. Let the authorities know that it's a suspicious-looking character 
murking and lurking around or something like that. You don't know you might stop a mass killing yourself just by being alert and letting their, let their proper authorities know when something don't look right. With that being said, this is old middle man saying, whatever you get, whatever you get into, again, if God ain't in it, please, man, please, sir, come out of it because it's going to come to nothing. You can believe that and take it to the bank. This is middle man saying peace and good morning.